Do the intro. Do the intro. It's the wheel. It's the it's the wheel of Mutt Super Bowl. Do yes, the sir. intro. Do the yes, intro. Sir. Come back here. Do the intro. It's the wheel of Mutt Super Bowl. We're going to the Super Bowl. You think you're faster than me? I'm faster than you. I'm faster than you. Wait, boy. Look at that shit, boy. Yeah. Let's go. What, huh? Go we'll talk to Black Santa, huh? It's not even Christmas anymore, Black Santa. What is wrong with you? you think I don't know what's the wheel of my Super Bowl? You think Mr. Cocktopus doesn't know? With the smoke, huh? Luna apparently doesn't care that it's the Wheel of Mutt no. Super Bowl, the most important episode of all Wheel of Mutt seasons. I'm messy, bro. I'm lying on messy, bro. The weakest defender in all of Argentina! <laughs> I got a video to do, Fobber. I gotta go. I gotta go, Fobber. I've got one final question for you, Fobber. Where's your wiener? Where's your wiener, Fobber? You going through the butt scratch machine? You wanna go through the butt scratch machine? Yep, go ahead. Yep. You wanna go one more time? One more time, that's it. That's all you get, one more. All right, go ahead. Okay, Fobber, now sit. Oh, jeez, you did that fast. Shake, wish me luck for the Wheel of Mutt Super Bowl. Luna! Shake, you know Shake. Yes! Good job, Fobber! Let's go, baby! POV, your cock. And of course, if you need Madden coins, make sure to go to instantmaddencoins.com. They sell coins on every single platform. You can also directly buy players or training points. Buying limiteds and quick selling them is probably the safest route, so I recommend that. This is a significantly better deal than what EA is going to offer you, and you can get 10% off when using the code MMG. Just use the link at the top of the description. Wheel of Mutt Super Bowl. It doesn't get any better than this. As we get into January here in February, I'm changing the schedule on MMG. I've been posting virtually every day for a very long time. And between the three channels, I'm burning out a little bit, but I don't want to sacrifice Wheel of Mutt. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to post a Wheel of Mutt every single Wednesday and Sunday. On rare occasions, there will be more Wheel of Mutts, but there won't be less. So every Wednesday and every Sunday around 8 p.m. Eastern-ish, you can expect the Wheel of Month. And that's how it's going to be moving forward. Now, every Monday and Friday, you can expect a super heater non Wheel of Mutt video. In between there, I won't post anything. I will be posting on MMG Live every single day. And on the Meegs channel, I'll post every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So if you just can't get enough Papa Meegs, you're more than welcome to check out all of those channels. But I want to make sure I'm not rushing videos anymore. I want to make sure I can do this for a long time. So that's the decision I made. Just thought you guys should know. Now on to the good stuff. This is a Super Bowl episode. Meaning I have earned myself one brand new prestige player. Additionally, there's a prestige player on this team who is eligible for an upgrade, but I'm not sure if I want it. Now, let me see if I can explain why that is. Christian Okoye, the Nigerian nightmare. I prestiged him because not only does he have awesome stats and he's a 91 overall, but he has his ability Vanguard. For three plays, he dominantly wins impact blocks. I feel like it has been amazing, but even when he doesn't have this ability on, I feel like he's a very good fullback. Why do I tell you that? I tell you that because Christian Okoye got a 95 overall fullback card. And it's been so difficult for me to decide what to do here. Now, on one hand, this Okoye, hands down, no debate, is significantly better on most plays. He's five speed faster, four more strength, four more carrying, four more catching, four more run block, four more lead block, three more impact block. He's obviously insanely better, but he does not get the Vanguard ability that Nightmare gets. So the question is really this, would I rather have a 95 consistently always or a 99 sometimes, but more likely than not a 91. It's a very difficult decision. And because it's the Super Bowl, I'm not making any changes. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. So I'm not gonna add this 95 Okoye right now. I'm sticking with the 91. But at the start of next season, I may reconsider and I may rock this 95 overall Okoye. Second thing that I need to consider is since I've made the Super Bowl, whether we win or lose today, the next video at the start of next season, my team will be reset, fully wiped, but one new player will be pursued. Prestiged. Now let's talk about who would be a really good prestige. Number one, I think Mahomes is an incredible prestige. He's so good. He has one of the best releases. He gets incredible abilities. And if anybody's going to get another card, it's Patrick Mahomes. Jalen Waddle might be a good prestige, but I've already got Justin Jefferson. So wide receivers are off the table. Nick Chubb and DeAndre Swift. I'm not interested in prestiging either of them. So they're off the table. Taysom Hill is a no. But as I told you guys, a reason that I got this Hawkinson is I would not mind at all prestiging TJ 
Hawkinson. Larry Allen would be a very good prestige. That would guarantee me a 93 overall right guard, one that will most likely be getting an ultimate legend. One that I'm heavily considering as well is Anthony Munoz. So there's this 95 overall left tackle Anthony Munoz. He gets awesome discounted abilities. He's an end game left tackle. And now I would have Jason Kelsey guaranteed and Anthony Munoz guaranteed at the start of every new season. Defensively, I'm not super high on anyone. I think Dexter Lawrence would actually be an incredible prestige because not only would I get the 95 D tackle, but I'd also get the 90 overall tight end Dexter Lawrence. Montez Sweat would be a good prestige. Max Crosby is due for a better card. He's not bad. I'm not going to prestige a corner because I've already got Sauce Gardner and Palomalu. Weapon X isn't bad either, but I'm not going to prestige another safety. David Mayo is a no. Isaiah Simmons. I'd love to always have Isaiah Simmons, but I just don't know if Isaiah Simmons is going to get another card. So I I'm definitely on the offensive train here, but that's all we've got. This is the Super Bowl episode. All right, gentlemen, it's the Super Bowl. Let's add to this squad. I would love a left guard. Going into the Super Bowl, if I can get a left guard, ooh. Does, does Zero Chill have a left guard? I don't know if Zero Chill has a left guard. I don't even know if Zero Chill packs are still in the store. Honestly, this is a pretty good wheel spin to get when you're in the Super Bowl because my team is really good. We kind of just need a Hail Mary amazing pull right now. So if we get it, Amazing. Additionally, if we got a player who has a really good prestige option, that'd be super good too. I don't know who that is, but 90 overall D-tackle, that's gotta be a better backup D-tackle than I have right now, right? Dude, I hate to be such a casual. I've literally never heard that name before. Ocho Cinco Kicker. Ah, it's probably not that bad, but I wanna keep in uh, Michael Badgley. I'd have to pull one of the 92s. Oh, there's a Lakin Tomlinson 92 left guard. If I can really beg for a player, that's exactly who I need. Nothing on that one. McCaffrey quarterback. See, like McCaffrey would actually be pretty nice nasty prestige because he's got a 93 but i don't want to do that either final zero chill pack we'd have to get really lucky here i'm not expecting too much but i've already got a d tackle eric mccoy center hey jerry hughes does that if he's really fast i guess i could put him at a linebacker but other than that i don't think he can do much 87 speed 62 kind of has linebacker stats anyway okay he may actually get reps so backup d tackle it's actually a really big upgrade i have Derek naughty in there so 90 overall kurt hinnish now linebacker no because i've got david mayo and Roquan. I don't think Jerry Hughes is better than either of them. He's not better than Max Crosby either. I guess Jerry Hughes just won't be getting any reps. But you know what? Kurt Hinnish. That's one of the few positions I could really upgrade with a 90 other than left guard. So not bad at all. All right. First wheel spin. Lancer's a 90 D tackle. Really lucky, but I'm not going to complain about it. That's awesome. All right. Let's see what we get on our next wheel spin. It's too elite. Oh, yes. That's perfect for what just happened. I just got so many elite players that I will never use on this team. Like, I got like three Samaj P Rhines in that. So I could take two elites, sacrifice them to get one 93 overall player. Also, before I do that, everyone was commenting how I forgot to use the free short in elite on Taysom Hill. I'm so sorry. I am an idiot for that. Instead of that anyway, I am going to start using deep out elite and tight end apprentice. And there is actually only one 93 overall left guard, but he happens to be like one of the best ones and he gets one ap post up he also gets one ap nasty streak uh so 93 overall alan Fanica left guard i'm sacrificing take your pick man i have so many extra elites from that pack opening i just did that aren't even gonna see the light of day on this team so alan Fanica finally got my left guard it only took me until the super bowl but he's 92 strength his run blocking is amazing. His pass blocking is amazing. He's, he's super, super good. And we're going to take that one AP post up, which I believe is right here. One AP post up. I have one AP available uh, on my uh, offense anyway, so that's perfect. Let's get him in there. Damn, I love my O-line right now. All right, gentlemen. What's going to be our last player to add this team? I don't even know what I would want right now. I think a more consistent linebacker might be nice. It's... Oh, <laughs> We got this one relatively recent too. Okay, so last time I did this, I went with the first letter of their last name. This time we're gonna go first letter of the first name. Hey, Echo. How did the lion greet the zebra? Dude, shut up. Very Why? nice to eat you. What the fuck is wrong with you? Hey, Echo. Here is a letter, R. So I can take any player whose name starts with R. First thing I thought of was Randy Moss, but I don't need Randy Moss. I think I'm going to go with Rod Woodson. He's honestly going to be a huge upgrade from Sauce Gardner. And if in this Super Bowl, we go up against some God tier wide receivers, I think it's going to be really good to have him. Rod Woodson, six foot. So he's right on the brink of almost being too short, but I think he'll get it done. Let's see him compared to Sauce Gardner. Yeah, he's got plus four speed. He is a lot shorter, but he's got jump. He's got 12 more play rec, which is huge and better. 
better man and zone in the same press. So we're gonna go Rod Woodson. Rod Woodson gets one AP crusher? Yeah, I'm putting that on. All right, gentlemen. Can't ask for much more. This is as good of a team as I'm ever gonna have going into Super Bowl. We are officially at 93 overall. I think a lot of God squads right now are 95 or 96. It's time for a challenge wheel. And then we hop into this game. Now, if I complete the challenge, we will get one of any pack in the store at the start of next episode 25 plus of five players it's very doable it makes me nervous in the super bowl but it's very doable and for the third straight playoff game i have no playoff logos on the field it really ruins my immersion bro i worked my ass off for the super bowl for just this regular ass looking game in ford field bro he's gonna go stretch left dickerson why does he why do he have twig legs and why is he so fast holy shit Shit. I suppose that's what I get for all the halfback stretches I've run, huh? Bull line stand now, I guess. Get him. Go get him! Let's go! Whoever the whoever finishes, bro, he got there. Alright, we're sending a heater now. Ooh, good ball. She got clamp up. Oh no, that's so bad. <laughs> I did not expect that at all. Nice play. 66 yard rush. Sacked him for 13. He got it all back. And with nine yards still, he runs the ball. Dude, I hate these Christmas cards, bro. We got Megatron corner. Harold Carmichael corner. Jesus Christ, look at this team. Ooh, right down the seam. <laughs> What? Hell of a start, ladies and gentlemen. Hell of a start. What the fuck was that? I'm seeing these six foot eight corners, dude. There goes Dakerson for 12. There it is. Wow. I. <laughs> We're like junior high schoolers trying to tackle the guy. Going up against six foot 10 defenders because there's Julius Peppers, free safety, Megatron corner, Harold Carmichael corner. There goes Taysom Hill. Nice move and nice blocks. No way, taste some. Oh no, there goes Megatron corner. <laughs> I hate that. Hey, great play. Proud of the boys on that one. Look at this. I got, you got a six foot, got Julius Peppers user in the middle here. You got Megatron on Waddle. Should be able to hit it again though. Wow, he is so out of position. Taysom Hill, keeping us hanging on by a thread here. Positivity, boys. We gotta be positive or we are gonna lose this game by so much. I gotta try a different defense. This defense isn't working. I'm gonna try 3-3 Cub, but low key against his stretch, I don't think this will work either. Ooh, nice. That's a great stop. Also, his Megatron is lit up. How? How the fuck does his Megatron have double me? Hey, nice play, David Mayo. Why does he have X-Factors? Yeah, he's just gonna fucking... Ooh, Let's go! And just like that! Why was Kyle Hamilton in? Why was David Mayo in? Why does he have all his... Oh, it's a momentum thing, isn't it? Away players involved in touchdowns or takeaways enter the zone. That's what it is. So he lit up his momentum that quick. He's expecting the corner route, so I'm going to put a crosser on Taysom. They're not open. I can put Taysom Hill down the seam. It's Waddle or Taysom Hill. Oh, Waddle. Waddle? Oh! No! No, 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 You didn't break that up? Damn it! Great play. I'm not... Whatever. I'm so proud of how we played that. I'll hit Taysom Hill this time. It's a tight seam, but he's there! And he catches it! Let's go, Taysom! Dude, right now, I think every yard I have is Taysom Hill, so I'm certainly not completing my challenge. But damn it, I'm keeping this game alive. And that's the most important thing to me right now. I'm gonna try and hit Waddle on this out route. Fucking Harold Carmichael corner. That's so stupid. God, put that big ass motherfucker out there on Jalen Waddle, bro. He would get his ankles busted. I don't think I can run it. I'm gonna try. That's with goal line back, mind you. That's what it looks like trying to run with goal line back. He didn't even blitz. His team is just that good. I'm gonna send TSML over as a decoy. Hopefully he takes it. Nope, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Where are you throwing? Where are you throwing? He's so open. I threw that ball to Y. He had just cleared the middle. He was so open. Look at this. He's right back there. He throws it right to the defender. And he just... And he has all that time to throw over the middle. That sucks. I don't even want to talk about that shit. I don't want to talk about any of this shit. This sucks so bad. He could very well be running this football. Good ball. That was a nice play. Gotta get a turnover. Uh-oh. I'm very out of position. I'm on Hinnish right now. Beauty. Beauty! Third and eight. Good stop. Put Crosby in coverage along with Micah. He's gonna playmaker this guy. Yep. 
Yup! Hey! Good stop! Max Crosby with a big one. He just playmakered him. Honestly, I would have preferred the pick. No way you go for this. He's just gonna heave one and pray. That's... I, I can't believe that. He went to Taysom Hill, too. He's probably his smallest receiver. This makes it look like Jalen Waddle's very open. I just have this feeling that he's not. Okay. Sandwich between Megatron and Carmichael. I'm gonna send Dexter Lords underneath. I will throw it to him if I have to. That is not very open. I've got a corner route on Waddle and a corner route on Hill. See how each sets up. Neither was really there. Jerry Rice didn't catch it, but that's okay. The, the clock is stopped. I'm over it. Go, 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 go. Yes, sir. Come on. Switch on. Oh, hell of a hit. Shit. Damn. He played that perfectly. I do have a field goal and the ball at half, and I should have focus. Why don't I focus kick? Doesn't matter. I hit it. Okay, that was a little scary. We proved a few things to ourselves. We proved that we can stop him, and we proved that we can move the ball down the field. We are losing by four, but I do get the ball at half. It's gonna be a tough game, good opponent. It's winnable. He's got five seconds left. He's gonna do some crazy shit, probably. I'm, I'm sending the house. Four deep, and I'm sending the house. I'm on hit. This is so bad. Just let him catch it, honestly. I literally just was running with him. I wasn't trying to do anything crazy there. Offensive abilities all look good. I'm not going to change them. Defense abilities all look good. I don't think I can run the ball against this guy. That's what sucks. I'd love to be using the run game right now. That D-line is insane. Let's go with a wing stretch. No Okoye, but... Dude, that box is loading. Those players are big as fuck. Look at this. Like, I'm running at Julius Peppers and Carmichael. Don't speak too soon, Matt. Taste him over the top. Beauty. We're hitting a little rhythm now, gentlemen. Taysom, once again, he's just barely past this man. <gasps> no, he's not in bounds. Damn. Mahomes! <laughs> Fourth and five, Mahomes up the middle. Absolute sketchball play calling right there. Don't, uh, kids, don't be like me. Monkey see, not monkey do. Monkey pee all over you. What? This might be my only way to beat this. I think Jalen Waddle can get off of that. No. That's fucked up. That's so fucked up. I hate that. Oh my God. And he's that fast too. That's just so ridiculous. I can't beat that man coverage. I'm just going to I'm gonna say it straight up. I can't beat it. I don't know how I'm going to, but I got to find a way. Dude, go watch that back. Watch this Harold Carmichael guard Jalen Waddle. I just like, I don't know what to do there. Yeah, we get it, dude. You're going to run press man coverage because you get no pussy. It's literally just overstorm rave. There's just nothing I can do about it. Ooh. That is the first time Jalen Waddle's busted that. <sighs> Finally. Jalen Waddle is beating Carmichael now. I don't know what changed. All of a sudden, he's beating Carmichael, though. Boys are getting tired. I'll go taste him. Oh! <laughs> Crazy. It wasn't even there. He didn't even go for it. It's going to be a lot of run plays now. Oh. Nice ball. Nice play. Nice ball. Good hit, Palomalu. This looks... Randall, Randall Cunningham. Ah, I can't even be mad about that. Randall Cunningham is pretty fast-ass quarterback. I can't do anything on offense. This is the most spoon-fed game, bro. Just buy the best... Here, here's roadmap to victory. Buy the best players in the game. Run man coverage. That's it. That's it. Where the fuck are you going, Mahomes? He's wide open. He's wide fucking open in the middle of the field. Oh, my God. I'm gonna... Dude, I'm gonna freak out. I'm really gonna freak out. <laughs> He's wide open in the middle of the field. That's how we missed the touchdown earlier. What is wrong with this dude Mahomes, bro? There's Jalen Waddle. Who drops his wide open pass. I'm gonna freak out. I'm gonna freak out. Mahomes can't even get his pass off because the man blitz is too fast. I've lost the ball once again. He's actually crazy dog shit on offense. But of course he's got Dickerson and everybody else. I can't return these. I gotta try something like crazy different. There's Taysom Hill in the middle. Oh. oh. Did you guys just play defense on each other? You're on the same team? I don't know what I got to do differently. There's no... Oh, that's new. That's new, and that's open, and that's third and five. Third and five. Taysom, high ball. Let's go! This game is not over! You bet your ass that when he comes back out here, he's going to be playing his heart out. Let's try this. Can't run the ball. He's not going to be messing around anymore, though. He's been throwing stupid stuff. Stuff he wasn't playing at the start of the game. Hello? Down at the 14. He's got some yards to go. So you can shoot clock and win the game. I've got the two-minute warning and three timeouts on my side. And we've been playing spectacular defense. There's the first of probably many handoffs, but a spectacular stop. Would you just hurry up, too? Okay. Okay. <laughs>
They're so fast. You don't need a good first quarter. You don't need a good second quarter. You don't even need a good third quarter. You just need one good fourth quarter. Come on, boys. The man coverage is going to be oppressive. It's going to be strong. He might lock up everybody for all I know. We're going to find a way. There's Nick Chubb out the backfield. Ow. This lays the hammer. It's second and four. I've got Chubb. Oh, no. You just stepped out of bounds, you dumbass. Dude, there's nobody on you. What would compel you to go out of bounds there? There's literally no reason. Mahomes, let's go. I'm ticking that clock. Taste him. Taste him. Get your ass. No. I dove. I dove. And he tripped. Do I come out and QB sneak? Is it as good as I bitch about? Is it really as good as I bitch about? You didn't get in the end zone right there! Are you sucking my cock? How did you not get in that end zone? Well, you're lying. He's getting in, right? You're lying. It's the Nigerian Nightmare's turn. Third and goal. How many times have people scored on you with QB Sneak? You mean, like, infinitely? And now it's fourth and goal in the Super Bowl! Three seconds left! I see something. My heart is beating out of my chest. Fourth and goal. Mahomes, redemption. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> Let's go! Dude, 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 like, do I have to proceed chase Hill now? Taysom Hill's the most monster game. You don't need a good first half. You don't even need a good third quarter. You just need a good fourth quarter, baby. Oh my god. I didn't get to see my challenge. I'd say there's about a 0% chance five different players at 25 plus yards. Pretty sure Taysom Hill about 150. And nobody else did shit. Mahomes? Super spectacular dog water. He missed that freebie, Tutty. I turned the ball over on a couple missed passes. I played like shit. I'm like Aang, bro. When the world needed me most, I vanished. Okay, wait, no, that's not right. I'm like reverse Aang. I'm anti-Aang. When the world needed me most, I showed up. I'm the opposite of your father. I didn't leave to go get milk. I just ordered it off of like Instacart or something. I stayed. At the end of a Wheel of Mutt season, you know the rules. I lose everybody on this team other than my prestiges. So you'll still see Kelsey. You'll still see the Nigerian Nightmare. You'll see Jay Jettas. You'll see Micah Parsons. You'll see Troy Palomalu. You'll see Sauce Gardner. As for everything else, it remains to be seen. Taysom Hill played so good. Oh my God. Either way, gentlemen, I love you. Thanks for watching as always. I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Holy shit. Peace out. Oh my God, that was crazy.